We did a lovely job of doing a fancy board. Like, nobody hated this girl of the day. Oh, God. Let's talk to the people that bought a podcast that we just listened to. This podcast. Oh my god, can you hey, guys just hello, give neighbors. me a moment? Hello, neighbors. How's it going, How's man? How's it going, man? Why you have me naked for the people? Wow, wow, hey, hey, wow. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, <laughs> 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 So guys, Marsha did a lovely job of doing a fancy board. <laughs> yeah, charcuterie board. And them two there. But I brought some toys so that Zaire can me and Zaire can play some different game because I cannot do the run of and done. <laughs> not 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 my style. But yeah, it's just a chill Saturday. No special event. Ew! Mouth water. The muskets are them out, guys. I'm gonna have a couple bites by the time we reach home. Because for some reason, them like my blood. people happy sunday <sighs> yesterday after the picnic we were good it was a fun day we were all we were just chatting it was really just nothing to like we went to the museum thing the week before and on our way home we we're like it kind of too early for go home but Orlando did have plans and marcia did have something to do so we we're like all right next week but we just randomly go have a picnic you know and then we invited some others who wanted to come but guys 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 <laughs> but guys let me tell you it was a great afternoon desafortunadamente unfortunately i like in the evening on my way home my start feel sick i don't know like i just regular stuffy Remember, you have to be careful, okay? Yeah, my side feels stuffy, and then I like at a regular kind of stuff away. Oh, yeah, you're just stuffy, and it'll go away by the time you probably get warm. I was literally feeling stuffy, and then my throat, I feel itchy, and my nose, I feel like it's a burn. So, I said, this feel like a sick man gets sick, you know? And I see what I like here. But I came home, I'ma just relax. I'm kinda got my bed late because we were up watching Formula One. The race is in Japan this week, so the race literally start one o'clock, one AM our time. In like Eastern Standard Time. So yeah. Zaire, remember you have to be careful. Anywho, I wake up this morning and I feel sick. I just can't bother. If I could, I would get takeout because I did some day and night. I literally day in the kitchen and I just feel all over the place. Come on. 
one second. No, no, no. You're going to sit down over there, but if you want me to scratch your back, come. Is your back still itchy? Yeah. Is it? I don't think it is. Can you turn that down a little bit, please? Turn that down a little bit. Not all the way down. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, guys. So, um, yeah, as I was going to say, I was just... My lot of willpower today. I was literally demotivated. My code about her. I was annoyed with myself. Um, but at the same time, I was about to give myself some grace because I'm like, you're sick, you know? How about you take some rest? We're trying not to buy takeout because we have a goal in terms of saving because we really want to get a house where Zaire can jump and do everything we want, to, right? So we're trying to minimize how we spend money. And then like to them, just a look at them and say, no, I don't want to be responsible today. Dad. The madness. Hi. <laughs> He's just coming from the gym. But yeah. Um, I was literally like, you know, I don't have the willpower to be responsible today. Like, I literally don't feel like it. But then, Zai, the cover is on the floor. But then, I went to listen to this Jay Shetty podcast, guys. Everybody whom we can share this with, woman, no, I do something. I'm going to share it with them. You feel sexy? <laughs> yeah, everybody whom we can share the podcast with you guys that, that this episode, I will. Because it was just so insightful. Knock knock. Knock knock. Jesus, oh my god. You could? I do skin in tea. Get him down here too. Oh my Oh my god. I want to put it in a circus. I'm going to circus in a circus in a day. Oh god. I'm going to talk to the people that bought the podcast I'm going to just listen to. Which podcast? The G Shetty. Oh my god. Can you guys just give me a moment? Hello, neighbors. How's it going, man? How's it going, man? Come on, man. Come on, man. We're outside, man. We're outside, man. We're outside, man. We are outside, man. Push, push your gang sign up. Push your no, gang sign excuse up. Excuse me? Gang sign. We're outside, man. We're not doing gang signs. <laughs> As a black man living in North America. <laughs> we have to be realistic about some things, yeah? I'm not sure the gang sign on a couple of Aye, yeah, yeah. No, do the walking finger. Walk it. Walk it. Good job, buddy. I have my naked fun people in TV. Wow, chicka, wow, hey, wow. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, that shit. <laughs> but yeah, guys, the podcast was so insightful. Literally, like, sometimes I think you need something for just kick you in the ass, for just to feel sorry for yourself. Watch of your course. Ass argument. Boom! I can't, I can't talk. Like, um, though I am sick and that's not something for say, I need to feel sorry for myself, but like, I literally listen to it though. And like my feel, it just felt good listening to something where I tell you, say you need not to make excuses for yourself sometimes, you know? Like the it literally I tell you about how you can trigger things in your brain by just stop stressing about specific things. So while I'm cooking, would I love watch certain kind of content because yeah, it would have relaxed me, but at the same time it's like Listening to something like this really just give me the motivation for doing what I need to do. The water is wet. And that you not understand. You not understand the water is wet. Well, what are you eating? And if you understand the water is wet, you will never. Are the cereal that you from there? Jesus. Come on. I don't want to see that. 
Anyways. At least call the party anyway. Yeah, but it's so work like this. Anyways. Um oh. as I say. Even at one point I'm gonna try to show you so like um there's like a key point of it where I definitely want to share. But like I must say, you have to really retrain your brain every day about how you want to feel, how successful you want to be, or just wh whatever you want to be. Like if you wake up every day and victimize yourself at the first thing in the morning, literally you're going to go through the day as a victim. So you're going to look and say, oh, I'm tired because I never get no sleep. Oh, I hate my 9 to 5 because my 9 to 5 does this. Like, we have to really reprogram what my, what mind for say. Or 9 to 5 helps us, pays our bills. Like, if it's not what we want to do, what are you doing to change that situation? Because you might not want to start a business. Like, you know, that's the thing right now where everybody has a yeah, man, start a business right today. But maybe not everybody wants to start a business. What do you want to do for yourself to change that reality to not be... Like, you know, caught up or obsessed or upset about it. Like, mega link the podcast below, guys, because only I give some snippets where it's not even the half of it. Like, it's such a powerful episode. And the person who was talking was a neurologist, I believe. I like them, I show you. Them, I tell you about them studies of them, do After them scan people's brains, when them think one way to the next way. Because, like, them, I tell you, says stress literally trigger certain things in our body it's like our brain's way of coping so like you must say if you're always stressing about something even when you don't have to stress you're triggering this emergency fight or flight reaction from your body which is eventually going to deteriorate and not be good for your body in a sense so like you must say of course you know we have to go into the fight or flight when we need it because Sometimes your life is in danger. But how about learning how to cruise sometimes instead of always being like, oh no, me need for this, me need for that, me need for this. Like, you're always just in that mindset. But you never yet just bring yourself down for say, I am grateful for where I am right now in this very moment. And, you know, just release some <laughs> dopamine by reflecting on that, you know? If you want to hear more, um, of this part like if you actually Mom, want to listen to this podcast are you okay? Are you what? Are you okay yes i am okay but that was not nice you don't crash into people that hurts i'm gonna finish up but yeah guys if you want to hear this podcast i'm going to put the link below um just so you can hear it too. And I think it's also important for parents to listen to it. L listen, parents, entrepreneurs, anybody who feel like they need to reprogram their mind because they feel like they're just stuck in a situation where every day they get up and they wonder why, what they want to happen, not happen. I think you should listen to this. It's a very, it's something that if you literally can apply it to yourself while listening, you'll get benefit from it. So, I'll leave the link below and at the end of that podcast he mentions a different episode and i think you should also listen to that episode i haven't finished listening to the episode yet but i'm listening to it now so yeah i think that would be good but yeah that's just my little tidbit for today i'm going to finish cooking um yeah but basically I'm almost done because Alanda bring the spaghetti and me had the spaghetti and meatballs. And that was like one of the main things I was trying to say. Like I felt so sick to the point where I literally just didn't want to be responsible and cook. I just didn't want to buy something. But that would have mash up the goal, right? So while listening to it, me look and I say, yeah, me can do this. I can do this. Like me just being at the kitchen, just bend up and curl up, just feeling sorry for myself because I feel sick. Me I said, no, but it's all mash up the goal. But if me focus upon the goal and say this is what i need to do just do it like it not gonna take that much time out of you literally a while ago my season up to me cook one put the other one in the freezer and i was dreading doing the other one but me just look on it with a positive outlook that at this will benefit future me <coughs> at another week i got great to say at the panda sunday the season up the chicken thighs because that easy for cook in another week so i just think we just have to approach a lot of situations like that to have a better 
outlook on the situation. Yeah, girl, say I'm mad. What do you mean? Oh yeah, talk to myself. I have to talk to myself. <laughs> I bet you some care about Bellevue. You can call it the Milo. You that care just the Milo? No? Oh, you mean? That's it. They're not giving nothing else to Canada. A cup of Milo. They're not giving a cup of Milo. One pack. One and eight pack of Milo. There. How much is that worth? Me, as a human being. How would you if function if without me? How would you function without me? So you're gonna carry me in for your eight pack of Milo. When the eight pack of Milo done, what will you do with yourself? How will that replace me? We broke out and carry your box and collect eight more. <laughs> and you just keep the cycle repeat. going. Rinse and repeat. What happened weird? Oh, this is what we're gonna report and repeat. Report and repeat. <laughs> Hey, do you think I'm a fool? Who do you get report from? I wish I wish someone would decide by the other day. I think I want Bob Marley. What is it, my dog? It was a Bob Marley, though, but it, it might not Bob be Mar- the same. Mar- Mar- no, it Simado might not be the same. No, it might not be the same. Yeah. But yeah, I'm telling you, I'm a broke down the song, I'm a dog. He's not. I'm a broke down the song, I'm a what them is for real. He's definitely not. Yes, man. What did he say? Careful, please. Remember, remember, ah. remember, remember Mama tell me. <laughs> Be careful how you go ahead first. I'm not understanding. I'm going to say, well, I'm going to say, 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 i am going to my yes. God, what a My God, thank you. I just got here last week. Oh. How's your hair growing that fast? <laughs> Say bye, neighbors. Bye, neighbors. Have a good <laughs> Sunday. <laughs> Be the next one. It'll be the next one. I have bottled at the end. Which one? <laughs> 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 you're a fool, you're like, what are you doing with that people? Oh, God. What you want me to do for mud? Happy or sad? Do you want me to be happy or sad? Happy. Okay. Ah, with knee cup. Oh my god, doesn't that hurt? The two of a knee cup. Anyways, guys, happy Sunday, and I am going to resume my cooking and done up the day because, yeah, tomorrow's Monday, so I just need to be prepared. Bye.
Guys, this is a wrap on the week. The vlog never long. Why you see so? The vlog never long, but why are you laughing? Exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah guys that's a wrap on the vlog this week the vlog never super long but instead of not giving you guys anything at all i'm just said why not just give you something you know like something we can go on for the week hopefully tonight we can re record at different beaver stations because the response was good to the beaver stations where people said they want to hear more i mean not a lot of people but a few persons come in and say you know the mother wants to more beaver stations so Hopefully we can um record a few videos for this week. Mini oh, no, no. Vapim the man. Anyways. Come on out watching the street alcohol. Um but yeah. Outside of that, we do an interview for something today. And if it if everything like base when we get the results, we'll make gonna know what it was. If we get in or we to get in. Because the people on edge. Yeah, then it's you know watch movie, you know watch show. Them not do them something there. Why you not watch show nowadays? Watch YouTube. I only watch YouTube and Netflix. Why do you not look for things? Guys, what kind of feel sleepy? Come here for wake up early this morning for just get the day started. We wake up from about eight o'clock. Hey. We sit one eight o'clock for long. So, <laughs> mega just. Start up my money now for me do laundry and then make us start to the videos together. You this forget you you forget it. You must get it. You know why? You do over here play aggressive with the pity. What you expect it for do? My word. <laughs> Don't kick me in my nuts. Anyways, um, yeah, guys. So. We just have to just start out to make sure so we have a vlog for tomorrow. Ooh. My apologies for the length. But also I want to say, your girl has been on fire. This week alone, yesterday, because we go up on the hike, I have 11,000 steps. The day before was like 8,000 odd steps. And then Tuesday was like 8,000 odd steps again. So like... I go out with my little self this week. I was really walking, so I kind of want to keep it up. I just tell myself to just go walk, don't overthink it. So when I come last night, though, I drop right asleep. Like, I sleep long last night, you know, and then when I wake up, I look and I say, Forget this. When I get, when I go wake up and do, go back to sleep. <laughs> yeah, mom, I just wake up and then go right back to bed. But yeah that is it for this week guys thank you so much for always supporting i appreciate you guys but probably i got think for try to do a different way for highlight comments in another video that's what i'm gonna do it yet but um yeah thank you guys for i almost for talk with them in my background i almost for talk with this one in my background i'm making a noise who's making who's causing him to make the noise anywho yeah I i'll see you guys next week have a lovely week and hopefully we'll have a baby session that come up on friday right orlando yeah. 
Okay. We're gonna record it tonight. Yeah. Okay. We're gonna record the session tonight after I go sleep. Okay. What you gonna talk about? I don't know what we're talking. You want to say hi? You want to say bye to neighbors? Have a good week. Bye. Tell them bye and say have a good week. You have to look. Me kind of record him the other day. I do it. Well, no, not the xylophone, Panda app. But that's a music obsession now. That's his latest music obsession. So, yeah, I will see you guys. That's the main question. Oh, okay. Boar.